reproducibility starts in the laboratory for sure with what you're doing and are your experiments reproducible? Are there any variables that you're not accounting for? When I read the paper and when we try to reproduce the same thing in the lab, we get something, but it's not exactly what have been reported. Same thing, copy paste. I think the reason is, I'm not pointing out that doing wrong, but the thing is like small details are missing. Yeah, so I think like documentation is the biggest thing. So I always tell my folks to really document every small thing that you notice. Budgets being what they are, you have to be careful not to run through reagents quickly. You have to order carefully and you have to make sure things are used before they expire the best you can. When I receive anything from another laboratory, we always confirm it is what it is. If it's a plasmid, it gets sequenced. If they're cells, we check them out as carefully as we can. In our uh, grant applications, we allocated for five lines to be authenticity. So they would be, uh, will be confirmed that uh, they are who they are. So I think that it is one of the uh, great and uh, also important aspects in the reproducibility of results in the lab.